You know, I don't mean to be a but, but some of y'all ain't gonna make it in tonight. I'm very sorry. Yeah, yes. I'm very sorry. I don't mean to be that girl, but some of y'all are gonna have to. I'm sorry. Honey, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but this is for the queers and the gals, okay? I'm very sorry, but some of y'all are gonna have to go. The heterosexuals. There are some heterosexuals that can come in. Yeah, you can come in. Yeah, yeah you can come in. But some of y'all. Yeah, I see you. Yeah, some of the straights. This is a different story. Some of y'all are gonna have to go. And if you wanna come in, you're gonna have to prove that you're not a straight. So bend over. Hello, my queens. It is I, the one who has more legs than a bucket of chicken pin. They have like a see. Zayni. Ooh, I love that sound, bitch. Mm. <sighs> You've been waiting for this one, haven't you? I know you have. So calm, calm, down, calm down, calm down. Calm down. How you doing, girl? How you feeling? You feeling good and sexy? Well, I hope so, honey. Cause this is one that people have been requesting, recommending. Some of y'all been recommending it like as if I did not know that this movie existed or have like I've never seen this movie. I'm like, have you seen my channel before? You you must be new. You must okay, you must be new. Cause girl, I grew up watching this movie. This is one of those movies that I grew up watching, like with Charlie's Angels, Death Becomes Her, The Birdcage. <laughs> They're just a group of films that I just grew up with. Like, I did not know a world where these movies did not exist. When somebody's like, let me recommend this, I'm sure you would love it. And I'm like, you'd have lost your mind. Like, I would get my license revoked if I didn't know about these movies. The gay mafia is real. I don't play with them, honey. No, ma'am. I don't play with them, honey. They show up to your Anyways, um, what was I talking about? Oh, two on food. Thanks for everything, Jew. Julie Newmar. Baby, this movie, oh my god. Like, how could somebody just hate this movie? Like, I understand that maybe it's not your cup of tea, maybe you're more into the, you know, butch stuff, I don't know. But, um, this movie is just pure joy. This is the type of movie that I watch when I'm feeling blue, when I'm feeling down, when the trade ain't coming over and, you know, I douched and everything and they bail on me or something. Now, I haven't seen this movie in... <laughs> From beginning to end, I haven't seen this movie in about two years. The last time I saw this movie, like fully, beginning to end, because they sometimes they be giving out TV and sometimes I'll like catch a scene or two. But this last time I saw this movie from beginning to end was when I first, oh my God, almost three years ago. I don't give up. Because the last time I saw this movie was when I first started my YouTube channel. This was the last time I set. Ooh. It doesn't matter how long it's been that I haven't seen this movie or something. For me, you just remember the lines, you just know the scenes, you just know what's gonna happen. It's kind of like writing a dick. You don't forget. <sighs> Anyways, because I don't want to waste any more time, I just want to get into this bitch. But before we do, my queens, if you enjoy me, and if you're not homophobic, then why don't you just like, subscribe, and ring that bell? I mean, what's the tea, sis? Like, what, what you doing here? But I ain't judging. Anyways, queens, let's not waste any more time. <sighs> Ugh. God bless Patrick Swayze, bitch. Ugh. Oh. oh my god, I'm so, I'm so happy. I <laughs> Ready or not, here, here comes, comes mama. mama. And where is the body? And where is the body? Not here, you scrambled egg looking bitch. <laughs> Cause I'm going faster than you can drive. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god. Ah! I'm sorry, I can't. I am body beautiful. <laughs> you know, I gotta give it up. You're not gonna catch me giving men props for doing the bare minimum. Straights, you know, straight men. But my god, when watching this movie, this is, you know, when some people say like, oh my god, why are you guys always complaining? You know when people say, when people bring up the argument like, we want to see more queer actors playing queer parts. This is one that I'm like, oh no, 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 no. Please give me, the, give me Patrick Swayze, give me John Lugazamo, give me Wesley Snipes. Like, I can't, you know, this is one that I'm like, uh, the same with Birdcage with Robin Williams. You know, obviously, you know, Nathan Lane is a big old queen. But it's just the matter of, let's have it on an equal playing field. Of course the streets can play gay. Of course, except for trans. That's different. Like, I wish a bitch would bring pose and not just see Scarlett Johansson showing up as Blanca. But like, what the f***? Who? Excuse me, bitch. I'm taking Coco Peru. And nobody <laughs> here tonight winning Miss Congeniality. Valentina's not there? Um, you don't love me. Oh my god, I miss going to drag shows. Oh my god. Lady Bunty! Ugh. 
Let me tell you right now, Lady Bunny is the most rotted <laughs> human being to ever walk this earth. I mean, just filth, disgusting. I mean, can you imagine just being around somebody who makes the most inappropriate jokes, like the most inappropriate comments, always talking about sex, just filth, and always turning a tragic moment into some sick, low-hanging fruit of a joke. You know what I mean? Put your hands together for Rachel Tension! I mean, whore. Mother. You better work, bitch. Gotcha. Do you know just the idea a black gay drag queen coming down in a confederate flag dress? Bitch, you know, it's just insanity. I love being gay. I don't know who he is, but if there's a snowstorm tonight, he's going on my tires. Oh. I have no idea what the f that means. I, uh, still, after, what, 25 years? I, chair. So excited, I could just spit. I usually swallow. Oh, ho, brother, ho, whoa, 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 now. Nah. You got too much dip on your chip. We have a tie! <laughs> tie? Oh, what you mean, tie? Who? Noxima Jackson and Miss Vita <laughs> Girl, Trinity and Monet still have PTSD. You still can't watch this movie, honey. I don't know if it's the nasty competitor in me, but the thought of a tie, bitch, I'd rather lose. Cause I don't want to share nobody. I, I, I'm, yes, I'm Petty LaBelle. I only want it to be one crown. Bitch. No oh, ma'am. Find out why that little Latin boy in drag is crying. Little, little Latin, Latin boy in drag. Why, why are you crying? crying? <laughs> Tom, you're so pretty. pretty. That's all. Oh, so yes, pretty. yes, of course. Somebody's always laughing at me, you know. <laughs> But maybe I'm gonna meet somebody nice. <laughs> Ooh, bitch. Take her with us. Now how are we gonna do that? Sell our plane tickets and the three of us go by bus. No ma'am. That chaw is Latin. She might turn out to be a Sandinista or something. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, no ma'am. I ain't I'm trading my damn tickets. I was bad enough I have to share with one other bitch. I ain't share with another. Mm -mm. I wish she was as beautiful as you. Oh, honey! <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> oh. I get it all the time though. People just stopping me in the street saying, please, how are you this beautiful? Like, you know what I mean? It happened, well, you don't know, but it happens to me on a daily basis. Ugh. All right, that was it. Que bellissima come va. Darling. Oh, shit, baby, you spoke French, how bad. I bow to thee, honey. Ay, papi, ay, tan chulo, mamita. El gusto es mío. No, 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 we have decided. Fabulous. We? We how about Schmend de Fer, train? Does it have a club car? Tell me, tell me, does it have a club car? <laughs> For me, if it looks like Murder on the Orient Express, like, you know, they, that, yeah, that, no, that's what we're talking, honey. But it, it, I ain't gonna be like one of the, that Sex in the City episode, remember? Well, I don't know if you remember, I don't know if you watched this. That was that one episode when Samantha and Carrie went, what was it, to San Francisco? And they were like, oh, yes, it's gonna be first class, honey. It's gonna be b bougie, honey, bougie. Girl, they show up there, they have the and shower on top of the uh, the toilet. I'm like, what? no, man. I'm starting to understand why there was a murder on the Orient Express. I'd rather walk to San Francisco. To our sort of oh, bitch. Julie Newmar has been watching silently over this entire conversation, and you were the only cat woman. Period. I mean, they were looking at Julie Newmar. I was looking at Ethel Merman. I mean, it's Ethel Merman. I mean, come on. Oh Lord. Yo, be it looks like it comes down to that age-old decision dial mm. or substance. Mm. Gotta leave this town, gotta leave this place. <laughs> oh, shit. She has a new album coming out soon. Release Me Volume 2. Release Me Volume 1 came out when I was in high school. I remember that. Being good isn't good enough. And she had a bunch of other. I. I'm about to lose my shit, bitch. Ooh. Why are you gay? Gorgeous. Stunning. Ugh.
Maps are cheating. That is just so idiotic to me. Like, I have never, and I understand it's always like a religious thing, and you know, it's like throwing away your kid because they gay and shit. Like, girl, this is the most stupidest thing. Like, you could have a beautifully decorated house if you would just keep your gay son there. I don't understand. Like, girl, what you doing? Now, it's different if they're ugly. You know, like, yeah, obviously, like, throw them out. Nobody wants that around. Ooh. Electric chair. <laughs> when a gay man has way too much fashion sense for one gender, he is a drag queen. That's right. I'm just a boy in a dress. Oh, Definitely. absolutely. I don't need this. Look at her running like she's running across the border. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Miss Chichi, Miss Chichi, is, is, she has a lot of potential. You know what I mean? Like, Miss Chichi thinks she's not a Tina. Meanwhile, she's just Serena Cha Cha. You know what I mean? Girl, the shade, the shade of it all. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know. It, it's just so middle America. People are gonna be cruel to us. It could get violent, Vita. You know, we have been there before. Trust me, I know. Especially after the wife finds out where her husband and I are staying, and then she sort of makes a scene, and then she brings out a gun, and then the housekeepers start taking pictures and all that stuff, and then I end up on Facebook, and it's like a whole mess. But I got time for that. Okay, let's move on. You'll meet many of your friends inside. Friends? Friends? friends. Okay, with the program, me has no one is so rich as to throw away a friend. Basketball! <laughs> Some shady shit <laughs> going on. Just some shady bitches. Like, so, okay, so what if some of these female basketball players look so butch that they can open a beer can with their pussy? That does not, y'all are just shady. Lost in the hot embrace of Damien's sinewy bronze flesh. Bitch, driving in the night road, especially being me from being to Dominican Republic, bitch. I remember being a kid and somebody, I forgot who it was that told me like these like scary stories and they would say like, they would be like nuns in the side of the road, like in the middle of the night, like waiting for somebody driving by to stop them and kill them or something like, ooh. That shit traumatized me, girl. Can you imagine driving in the middle of the road, like in the middle of nowhere, and you just see a nun just waiting for you? Ooh, bitch. We are three young career girls from career girls. You know, we don't go for that around these parts. White girls riding around with and Well, Tavita, talk to the man. You speak honky. Ooh, girl. I feel like I'm on TikTok. Get your hand off my dick, buddy. Well, I mean, he had it coming. Why well, was raggedy, greasy ass pig rubbing up against me like that? You crazy? I mean, I am easy, but at least ask. You know what I mean? He had his hand up my dress and yeah, mommy, the dress. Yeah. Was he beating you up? No, he wanted to know where she got her panties from. Mommies, don't quote me, but I think this one is deceased. I ain't not deceased, girl. Oh, I said, why should we blow? Should we? Baby, let me tell you something right now. I would have got. I would have taken off all his clothes. I would have taken the gun. I would have taken his wallet. We are committed murder we might as well rob his ass i would have bitch i would have left him naked and doused him with honey let some bears take care of him huh? probably take him in as one of their own oh yeah I, yes i would have taken everything honey uh -uh. when i was stuck here forever i knew see, it see, see. i didn't ask to come on this trip did i no, no I, I don't think, think so. so how are you gonna hitchhike huh if there are no cars stupid i'm not latina marilyn monroe i, I got, got more legs in a bucket of chicken pendeja de gracia <laughs> But now, can we talk for a minute, though? Talking about Miss Julie Newmar, I want to have a discussion with y'all. I want y'all honest opinion. Who do you think is the best cat woman? I want a real tea, bitch. Now, personally, when I think of cat woman, there are three that come to mind. In no particular order, Michelle Pfeiffer, Eartha Kid, and Julie Newmar. Whore, let me tell you something right now. They are so different, but they have so much in common because they are just, it's just sex. It's just the sex appeal, the beauty, irresistible to men. I mean, no, I'm not talking about myself. I'm talking about Catwoman. This whore needs to clean her mirror. Oh my God, that no one can touch. Not Anne ha Now I'm not judging whoever you say is the best Catwoman, but if somebody says Anne Hathaway, I might block you. I love Anne Hathaway, I think she's great. But bitch, she don't come Look to the queens. That is Miss Arthur Kitt, Miss Julie Newmar, and Miss Michelle Fafa. But no judgment. I just want to know who y'all think is the best cat woman. I, I, I can't say who's my number one. My number one, I would probably have to agree that it is Miss Julie Newmar no, because she has this feline look and the the waist is like this. The proportions and the face is just like. It, and the way she walks. If you watch the Julie Newmar Batman, it's Julie Newmar. Literally, I'm just watching it in awe, and I'm like. How is this human? The sex appeal and the way she talks, oh. I can give you more happiness than anyone in the world. <laughs> That's all you need. Ooh, my nipples are getting hard, bitch. Oh, wait. You need a ride? 
and I just need to go pick up my friends, all right? Pop in. Bitch, that's on some movie. Cause that, if that would ever happen to me, honey, midget hitchhiking in the middle of the middle of nowhere, girl, I end up tied up to some basement fighting for my virginity, honey. Mm -mm. Well, ladies, welcome to Snydersville. Girl, this is I'm doing a Katy Perry concert. Then why don't you buy her music? This is the presidential suite. You know what I think? The last black person to stay here was Sam Cooke. Girl, when I was a kid, I didn't know who the f Sam Cooke was until I googled what happened to Sam Cooke in the motel. Girl, I was like... What? Girl, I'll tell you this right now, honey. Thank God I wasn't the housekeeper that day, bitch, because I wasn't cleaning up all that mess. Look up what happened to Sam Cooke if you don't know what happened to Sam Cooke in the motel, bitch. I love roughnecks. If I was your bread, would you be my bottle? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, me. We were wondering if maybe there were some historical points of interest that we should not miss. Whore, there is a pink and white trailer park in front of you. I don't think this is a place of high society. Her and her husband ain't had sex for nearly seven years. Seven years? Girl, that pussy must creak. Woo. Are you crying? No, I'm just uh, chopping onions. Oh, oh, may I? I wish a bitch would put their mouth in my spoon, bitch. I'm gonna be like, bitch! <laughs> bitch! I don't know where your mouth been. Virgil does like his way, doesn't he? I can't help but observe right now, there are no chopped onions anywhere. Bitch, Virgil needs a knife up his d**k hole, beating up Stalker Channing. You crazy, bitch. Stalker Channing, can we take a minute to appreciate the excellence that is Stalker Channing? I mean, a 65-year-old woman playing a high school student. Oh, the talent. Nobody can play Rizzo like Stalker Channing. Sucking cock all through the night. Restaurants for brunch. <laughs> that is wrong. That is just wrong. I mean, he didn't have a glory hole or a bathhouse or something. Just inaccurate. Like Zima Jackson? Not like Zima. Zima. Mm -hmm. Just his daughter. We here are working on decorations for the strawberry social. We all make strawberry pies. And we eat the strawberry pies. And we go home. Ooh, girl, you better calm down. Y'all wildin'. What do strawberries say to anyone here? Ugh, when you shave your legs and then that strawberry look on your legs, that's disgusting. That's all. That's why you have to exfoliate and all. You know, you know what we should have today? A day with the girls. A, a day, day with, with the, the girls. girls. What's a day with the girls? Well, maybe you start off the day with a little bit of yoga, you know, a little bit of exercise, then you have a nice breakfast, or maybe like a nice brunch, you get all drunk up, honey, hire a hooker, take turns riding him, honey, and then you go to his friend's house, and then there's a gang. I don't think we're gonna have much luck. Oh! 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 Look! They're from the 60s! If you ever wonder what I look like thrift shopping, yeah. This ain't far off. It never. <laughs> so, and she never said. I don't know, but for me, I've always found a stutter charming. There's something so endearing and sweet about a stutter. But I guess that's because I met a lot of men that have stutters, and I find it really charming. Well, they, they don't have stutters, they just become speechless whenever they take a look at this beauty, honey. Come on, Grandma Moses, give it to me. That's right. You got to turn it out. Ooh, check yourself, Loretta. Gorgeous. Oh, I love the pattern on that dress, bitch. Ooh, very poochy. Girl. Still too spicy. It's too goddamn hot. What's wrong with you? Oh my, did you? Here, put this on. Oh, no. I can't do that. It's too big. Honey, it can never be too big. Here, put this on. Oh, yes, I can. Tell it to my ass. Oh, honey, my asshole went from a donut hole to play doh that was left in the summer sun. Come to ask somebody out of sociable. Well, I declare. I declare. I decline. We will not be going out with Mr. Bobby Ray. Well, now we got a lot in common. Like, for starters, the same business in between your legs. Boink, 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 boink. Girl. I'm staying, okay? Well, all right, Miss Jennifer Holiday. <laughs> Don't forget to write. That's right, honey. Baby Chi Chi done lost her damn mind, honey, because you know how it goes, bitch. They go down there, honey, they see that binga, bitch, and you end up on the 5 o'clock news. Virgil's beating up Carol Ann. We have to help her. There are times when if you help people, you end up being killed. That's right, baby. I am not getting involved in no damn fights, in no art. No, 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 ma'am. Because let me tell you what happens, honey. I end up getting a knife up my ass, and I am not... Let 
let me just think. I may be nosy, but what I am not is about to get involved in the middle of a fight. Bitch, I ain't nobody's bodyguard. Do I look like Kevin Costner? D no, I ain't getting involved. I'm calling the cops, but I'm not getting involved. Not this delicate flower, honey. No, ma'am. What the hell? Ooh. Some ladies need to get hit. Some men need to be hit back. That's right, bitch. Baby, I wish, I wish, oh, I wish a man would put his hands on me. Let me tell you something right now. If, if, if a man ever put his hands on me, baby, let me tell you something. I would wait until he fell asleep. I would put that iron on steam right in between his legs, bitch. Ooh, let him hit a Mariah No, I would, girl. But I mean, I had a man once that put his hands on me. Yeah, no, I don't talk about it a lot, but it was like, it was intense. He liked, you know, he liked the choking and the slapping and throwing across the room and all that stuff, honey. <sighs> I mean, I would have kept seeing him, but he moved out of the country, so. Uh, 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 look, honey, if you want them to know that there is steak for dinner, you've got to let them hear it sizzle. Mm -hmm. Understand? That's right. But, honey, I could open a damn steakhouse and ain't no man coming over. I'm sorry. Chi-Chi? Bobby Ray, come here. Bitch, you got cataracts? Woohoo! Chi-Chi, bitch. Would you like to dance with me? Sometimes it just takes a fairy. It do. It do. You know, I do have one problem with this movie, and I want to be serious for one minute. I just don't like the way that they just portray, like, gay men as being, like, this flamboyant, over-the-top, effeminate man. Like, come on, not every gay man is like that. Men wanting to be with one another. Men touching each other. Rubbing up against one another. Ooh. Touching each other. Ooh. Um, excuse me a few minutes while I jerk off. If we're going to be friends, there really is something I should tell you. Adam's apple? Women don't have Adam's apples. Then, then you know? Honey, Helen Keller knows. Don't protect these freaks! These boys in dresses! This bitch needs some head. Like, girl, get a f***ing life. Whew. Girl, bruh. Whoever went after this shoe, come forward now! Mm. There's something so sinister yet so fabulous about a red wedding like dress. Oh my god. Oh, my nipples are getting hot just thinking about it. It's just so, I don't know, it's so sadistic. It's so twisted, but so fabulous at the same time. I don't know why. It gives me like very like Beetlejuice meets like Night of the Demons kind of vibes. I live. I live. I live. That shoe is mine. She's not the one. Bitch, shut up. I am a drag queen. I have I love that outfit. I love that outfit. I would have cut it a little bit shorter so I can show the stomach, you know, bitch. But I live in that headband. Ooh. I'm gonna drag queen over here. Ooh. You have no idea how dangerous these people really are. Girl, they're drag queens, not from Al Qaeda. What? Ooh. Come on, come on, give it to me, give it to me, bitch. Gorgeous. Ah. Come here. <laughs> oh my god, oh, I love this movie so much, I can't. Get out of the way, bitch. <laughs> do what you wanna do. Uh, who would dare hate this movie? I love you, Miss Peter Boehm. I've waited my whole life to hear those words said to that name. I'll tell you this much, honey, Miss Patrick Swayze learned how to walk in them heels, bitch. He was like, you ain't gonna catch me slipping, bitch. I don't think of you as a man. And I don't think of you as a woman. I think of you as an angel. I think that's healthy. I'm still waiting for one of the queens as an exit line, like when they got eliminated. They just turn back and say, Rue, I don't think of you as a man. That would be so funny. Oh my god. Anyways. Anyways. Gorgeous. Stunning. Oh my god. Ugh. Step four, larger than life. Uh, who wants to play with black and white when there's all these colors in the rainbow, bitch? Ooh, uh, gorgeous, gorgeous. The skin, the shade matches the skin tone. Stunning. Miss Julie Newman. Mm, uh, you look good, bitch. Mm. Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
My god, this is such a fun movie. I can, I am, I will never get tired of watching this movie. This movie is just pure camp, fun, it's just, it's just beautiful, it's just queer, it's amazing. I love this movie so much. Oh, I love, I love this movie, I love this movie, I love this movie, I will always love this movie, it is so so, ugh, I don't even know what to say. I just love this movie so much. I always have a fabulous, I mean, I'm so happy that I finally got to do this on YouTube. Cause, oh my God. Cause I don't think, has there been a lot of reactions to this movie? I don't think so. There should be, this movie's fucking fabulous. Anyways, Queens, I hope you had a fabulous time with me. I, well, I don't think we ever talked about it, but I'm definitely, I'm definitely a Ms. Noxzema with a Chi Chi rising. Yeah, mm-hmm, I'm definitely, a, yeah, this is like a balance book. I'm definitely not Vita. I'm not Vita, I am not Vita. First of all, I know, I know. I don't like getting involved in other people. Well, I'm nosy, but I don't like getting involved in other people. Anyways, Queens, who are you? Who are you? Are you Vita? Are you Chi Chi? Are you Noxima? Are you the cop? Mm hmm. Anyways, Queens, I hope you had a fabulous time, but most importantly, I hope you know how to keep it right. Keep it tight. And I'll see you until next time, Zollings. Oh, my. Yeah.